personal persons. Raise your right hand if you believe. Alright. Amen. Amen. Uh, number two, do you accept the death of Jesus Christ on Calvary as the atoning sacrifice for your sins? And believe that by God's grace, through faith in his shed blood, you are saved from sin and its penalty. Amen. Number three, do you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior? Believing that God in Christ has forgiven your sins and given you a new heart. And do you renounce the sinful ways of the world? You may raise your hand. Amen. Number four, do you accept by faith the righteousness of Christ? Your intercessor in the heavenly sanctuary. And accept his promise of transforming grace and power to live a loving, Christ centered life in your home and before the world. Amen. 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 Number five, do you believe that the Bible is God's inspired word? The only rule of faith and practice for the Christian. Do you covenant to spend time regularly in prayer? And Bible study. Amen. Amen. Number six, do you accept the Ten Commandments as a transcript of the character of God and a revelation of His will? Is it your purpose by the power of the indwelling Christ to keep in this law, including the fourth commandment, which requires the observance of the seventh day of the week as the Sabbath of the Lord and a memorial of creation? Let me raise your right hand. Amen. Amen. Do you look forward, number seven, to the soon coming of Jesus and the blessed hope when this mortal shall put on immortality? As you prepare to meet your Lord, will you witness to his loving salvation by using your talents in personal soul winning endeavor to help others to be ready for his glorious appearing. May raise your hands. Amen. Amen. Number eight, you accept the biblical teaching of spiritual gifts and believe that the gift of prophecy is one of the identifying marks of the remnant church. What does the church say? Amen. Amen. Number nine, do you believe in church organization? And is it your purpose to worship God and to support the church through your tithes and offerings and by your personal effort and influence? Amen. Amen. Number 11, number 10, sorry. Do you believe that your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit? And will you honor God by caring for it, avoiding the use of that which is harmful? And abstaining from all unclean foods, from the use, manufacture, or sale of alcoholic beverages, from the use, manufacture, or sale of tobacco, in any of its forms for human consumption, and from the misuse or trafficking in narcotic and other drugs. Number 11, do you know and understand the fundamental Bible principles as taught by the Seventh-day Adventist Church? Do you propose by the grace of God to fulfill His will by honoring your life in harmony with these principles? Amen. Number 12, do you accept the New Testament teaching of baptism by immersion and desire to be so baptized? as a public expression of faith in Christ and His forgiveness of your sins? Amen. Amen. Last one. Do you accept and believe that the Seventh-day Adventist Church is the remnant church of Bible prophecy and that the people of every nation, race, and language are invited and accepted into its fellowship? Do you desire to be a member of this local congregation of the world church? Amen. 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 Yes, uh, church, you have seen them. They have made a commitment before the Lord. They are making a commitment that they have no power to fulfill. Amen. Yeah. Whatever we 
same commitment to God, we are doing it as an exercise to show our willingness. It's only by His grace and power that we can do anything good. Amen. Amen. Now, these people do not need our stones. They probably have enough of their own. Yeah. Amen. Amen. But they need our support, they need our encouragement, and they need us to be there for them. So that they can continue working this journey in the sunshine, in the rain, in the storm, and in the fire. Amen. Amen. Right now we are going to proceed and go forth into the baptistry. They are going to change and you will see us go in here. Um, yes.